Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this message. So today, everyone, I'm here with a channel messages reading from your person for all of my Pisces watching. So if you have Pisces as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, this message might apply to you. Your person, Pisces, is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation and communication at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart is your person, that's your person, and you'll know. Before I do get into this reading, please keep in mind this will be a general reading for the sign of Pisces, so it may not resonate or relate to you specifically, and if it does not, please don't take it personally. And also, Pisces, I did want to announce that I did create a second channel where I will be posting other videos um, besides love readings and um, tarot readings. So if you are interested in seeing more videos from myself, then Feel free to subscribe and check out that channel. The link will be in the description. But without further ado, let's go ahead and see what we have from your person. Some messages from your person, Pisces. Also some overall messages regarding the connection you're in currently. So we do have our first few cards here, Pisces. First we have we are we're still learning e we're learning each other still. I'm not trying to excuse behavior. You are golden, you glow naturally, one out of one complete beauty. I see your beauty, I care more about your mind. And you're the one I want to spoil. So Pisces. Also, before I do get into this reading, please keep in mind if I'm speaking from your person's perspective or describing their energy, that could be how you feel the roles could be reversed. Just however this reading resonates for you. This is also a timeless love reading. So any energy I'm describing throughout it can apply to the past, the present, the future of your connection. And if you're not connected to anyone at this time, this could be someone from your past or someone who's coming towards you. So far, Pisces, I do feel like you're connected with a new person that you already know you want to pursue this connection with. You You can already see you two being together. Um, but I do feel like this is a fresh connection, something new, and you're maybe just like drawn to this person, like this person has your attention. Um, you know you want to move forward with this person, but... I feel like you're also just thinking about how you two may have just met or things have just taken off and you still have to see if this person is as solid as you are. Um, so Pisces, first we have, you're the one I want to spoil. And remember, roles could be reversed. Um, so I feel like this could be your energy or your and when I say roles could be reversed, um, just it's vice versa. I just want to clarify that. Um, but Pisces, I feel like this is your energy towards your person. You're just feeling sure about them. Um, Pisces, I'm a Pisces Venus, and it's easy for us to romanticize the smallest gestures out of love. Um, so I feel like you, Pisces, this person, their, their aura, their vibe, their, their energy, it's just very attracted to you and you, you maybe can't help but just get consumed by it, just how good they make you feel or even thinking about this person, just how happy you become. Remember, roles could be reversed. I see your beauty. I care more about your mind. This is also your energy, Pisces. 
you want to make sure that there's a deeper connection than just the surface level. You already know the reasons for why you're attracted to your person, whether it's the physical, well, obviously both, but um, you're, you're not trying to just get caught up in, in the external factors of this person. You want to make sure that they're genuine, that their love is real. What they're putting into this connection isn't for any other intention or motive. You are golden, you glow naturally, one out of one complete beauty. You can of course take this message for yourself, Pisces, but I feel like this is how you feel towards this person. We're learning each other still, I'm not trying to excuse behavior. I feel like this is also your energy, Pisces. Kind of like how I brought up, um, it's easy to romanticize for anyone regardless of what sign you, you are. It's easy for anybody to romanticize small things. Um, so you may have had some things that, maybe some red flags that you didn't really focus into, but you're still like taking note on it. Um, but you're, you're, you're trying to make sure that you're, you're not falling for this person for the wrong reasons or they're not gonna try and like swindle you in, in any way. So let's go ahead and see what other messages we have for Pisces. Pisces. So we have our next few cards. We have, we can be independent while still being close. I'm only accepting maturity, nothing less. I stay because I care. That doesn't mean I don't have a breaking point. So Pisces, I feel like with your feelings evolving for this person, you're also at the same time being very mindful of your energy and trying to protect your heart. Um, I'll start with I stay because I care. That doesn't mean I have I don't have a breaking point. I feel like this is your energy, Pisces. Not that anything happened within this connection. Maybe this card does resonate for this person. Um, but I feel like this is you and your past relationships. You trying to work things out because because you do care. You do have real feelings, and you you wouldn't want to see them go to waste or feel sorrow or anything like that. But you can only give so much of your energy until you, you feel like exhausted. So I feel like you're trying to establish your, you have a, like a good idea of, of what to accept and not to accept for yourself, even if it's hard for you not to accept things, if that makes sense, Pisces. Like, no matter how much you you care about this person or how much your feelings grow for this person, I feel like you're going to honor yourself if they do disrespect you in any way or if they do um, not show you the love that you deserve or if they, they mistreat you, Pisces. We have, I'm only accepting maturity, nothing less. This is also your energy, Pisces. We can be independent while still being close. I also feel like this is your energy, Pisces. Um, because you might feel like your feelings are deep for this person, they're heavy, but you don't want to just get all wrapped up into this because I, I feel as though this is a newer connection. So you want to maintain your, your independence um, regardless of how this connection turns out, whether whether you two pursue it together or, or not. You want to remain or keep your independence and still put time and energy into yourself so if things didn't work out you would still be you would be better prepared for yourself Pisces I'll put it like that but let's go ahead and get the last few cards for Pisces All right. 
And then we did have one card that fell out. I'm just gonna get that really quick. Let's get one more card for Pisces. Okay, so, ooh, I am sorry about that, but we have all I want with you is something healthy. Don't question my love for you. And we also have Karmic Cycle. So Pisces, with this Karmic with this karmic cycle card, I feel like you're trying to break your habits from being in a karmic cycle. Um, just as far as like codependency and really letting someone else's emotions and their actions and feelings affect yours. I feel like you're really trying to just keep that self-love within no matter how this connection sways or how it turns out. Don't question my love for you. I feel like this is your energy, Pisces because your love is going to be intentional towards this person so there's no reason to question it and then lastly we have all i want is something healthy with you or all i want with you is something healthy this is what you're asking for pisces i'm only accepting maturity nothing less we can still we can be independent while still being close you just you just want something healthy pisces you're you're being intentional with with where love takes you but you're also taking on the lessons that you've learned within and doing that pisces it's only going to open up the abundance for you way more so i'm proud of you pisces <laughs> but yeah i will go ahead and leave it at that that's all i do have for my pisces today as always i appreciate the love and support please like comment and subscribe and i will talk to you next time bye